We got two four inch flat tires and a 750 watt motor versus all these steps of justice. Seven speed, step through low frame, 750 watt motor, 48 volt, 20 amp removable battery, this side up. Never use this product out of the spaces authorized by regulations. Whenever you ride this product, you are at risk of losing control, injury, or death caused by collision or falling. We'll read the rest later. Okay, so I like e-bikes, especially when they come in a box with an inspiring message. Electrify your lifestyle. these bikes are pretty similar you kind of know what to expect front headlight rear brake light disc brakes luggage rack lockout front forks it's got a step through frame which is great for older people or women who wear pencil skirts it's got five different speed levels it's got pedal assist 750 watt motor it's a class 3 e-bike but one thing that surprised me, it actually has a shock in, in the seat. There's like a spring in the seat stem, which is cool, but it's really cool when you weren't expecting it. And I was like, is the seat gonna fall off? Why is it so bouncy? But uh, you know, it's just for a smoother ride. You know what else is for a smooth ride? Okay, so this is really the most important thing about one of these bikes is the fat tires. I think it's really good for safety, which I'll explain here in a second, but this bike isn't really, um, the, the fat tires could be, uh, uh, it could give you the wrong impression that this bike is for off-road. It's really not. I, I would not feel comfortable taking this off-road other than maybe like a gravel road. It's really tall. The geometry is for cruising. It's not an aggressive geometry at all. But the fat tires actually really help for urban situations. Most of the time when somebody gets hurt on, on a road bike, it's from like hitting a pothole or um, getting your tire stuck in a gutter or something and flipping over. These tires will really help with urban situations. Cracks, potholes, riding off curbs, riding up curbs, you could probably even ride this thing up a couple sets of stairs. Here's what we all wanna know. How many stairs can this thing go up? Three, four? That felt so easy. I am gonna try to find five stairs. If I could find five stairs, I'm going for it. One, two, three, four. Let's see what we got over here. One, two, three, four again. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, five steps. Let's see what we could do. I think the Hay Bike Explore is up to the challenge. Five stairs, I think we got it. Vancouver as a town doesn't have a lot of stair sets. I know that from the uh, days of riding BMX and riding around looking for, for uh, staircases to jump off of, but there is one place that has some stairs, at least more than five. The Clark County Courthouse. 
Don't ask me how I knew that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I know I could at least make it to the pro choice step, but we'll see. We'll see if I can do all seven. to find myself a challenge last time i was at the courthouse i didn't remember the uh mariachi music i was like dude where is that coming from where's that sound coming from i guess there's a somebody washing the windows over there thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed the video make sure you smash that subscribe button smash that like button and peace out